Hello everyone, I'd like to share with you a few trades posted on Friday 23rd of September. This clip was shared by SH uh, who's shorting Aussie and this is showing one minute charts and is waiting for the pullback on the downtrend channel on trading charts to be completed at this point. And as you see here, we are waiting. Now he entered here and with exit strategy number one he is uh, trying to manage the trade so it's now at break even level and the price is at break even here so he's trying to reach the other side of trade here that was one trade. This is another trade that entered the gain and reach targets. So, so thank you, SH, for sharing your trades on Aussie with us. This trade was shared by Easy, who's shorting S&P 500 CFD using Forex Broker. The macro chart is in downtrend. The trading chart is also shown here. Clearly, we have a downtrend channel and he waited for one minute entry uh, trading chart to re-enter at the proper position based on algo four and five and entered here and reached the target in the middle of channel based on exit strategy number one thank you very much easy for sharing your trades with us uh, the next few trades were shared by castro our global instructor showing that he is trading uh, Dow Jones Industrial Average uh, which is US 30 in form of CFD and his shorting as you see here this that is a line in one minute chart with higher time frames and uh, the position uh, entry is here with the trailing stop that is managed now and if we replay the clip that was taken live in the market we see the outcome so the this trade was closed here so if we go to the next trade here again another position short position was taken when the pullback was in right entry area based on algo 4 and 5 and entry signal so th the major channel is this one that is accelerating the trading channel is here with the proper range and entry is in right area with the proper stop that is trailed so this is a live clip of this trade and uh, a stop is moved and trailed here and we can see that when the trade closed with profit okay here at this position now the next trade is this one another re-entry so you see all these pullbacks were taken uh, and was closed in almost in the middle of channel with exit strategy number one but it's tra trailed so there's a room that if the market fall very rapidly the trailing a sub can give much more profit so let's see this one in live market when wa was recorded live so the trailing is behind the price and moving the more the price fall the more trailing get close to the price and protect the profit and is going more down and got out with profit here very good risk to reward ratio and high probability uh, this one when uh, the market retested the uh, support area a few times and got rejected we see that 
at this level the breakout shows that market uh, buyers came back and, and now you can see the uptrend channel that is tradable so Castro is waiting for uh, pull back to be completed here and reentered here in long position and uh, let's look at the trade now this is almost close to the level and reach the profit now here thank you Castro for sharing your trades with us uh, and appreciate it uh, the next few trades were shared by Yan, our global instructor that is trading micro Nasdaq futures and as you see the macro structural charts both are in downtrend there's a pullback in the structural chart and he's waiting for this to be completed and see the sellers are coming back to enter short position uh, in the same direction that is with the the structural and macro so that creates high probability trading area which is algo one two three passed and after entry the ATM managed the trades he enters here again and this one is stopped out but again re enter because the sellers are getting a strong now you can see from the shape of candle and order flow tick NYC now it should accelerate even more the sellers gain momentum now and tick NYC divergence is down plus it's below zero So very good. More pullback and reentry. Now we're getting close to this pervious support area here, and we see if sellers are still take the price even further down. Okay, ATM came out with break even but this one seems is working anyway that was end of his trade these are profit factor percent win and win to loss ratio thank you Yan for sharing your trades with us so these are a few trades that I uh, took live and this shows the news and we had a major news at 945 and so we let that pass and then we had a chairman of the Fed speech that uh, I tried to avoid and tried to trade between 9.45 and the chairman speech. So let's see uh, some of the trades recorded live. So you see after the economic release, we had this kind of high volatility that is uh, one of the major filters plus the market is not trendy it has to break above or below this level so we can trade it so I go away and come back to check when the price passed this and this level at this point was broken down so I started taking short position because we have a trend and its momentum is acceptable so I'll go one two pass I'll go three pass because of alignments of the three charts and uh, just we need to get a good pullback and good risk to reward ratio which is algo 4 and 5 so I enter limit here because volatility today was high and I take light position unless the trend is very strong so these are some of the trades now you can see uh, that was taken in high probability trading area only short position and that was after the the sellers are out of momentum here you see that the buyers are coming back so 
this channel was traded short now I'm trading long positions because the buyers are coming back so I repeatedly take long position from here that was a choppy area after news so now this area was a smooth so I took a lot of positions here only shorts and that's around middle of the day now this is another area that is high probability now there's alignment between uh, 10 second and 1 minute charts so high probability trade area I'm adding position and managing risks aggressively to take profit in this area ATM also helps to close positions automatically these are more trades close to the chairman's speech so the volatility is high I just trying to finish this and avoid trading anymore because volatility is getting more now the range is expanding and the price becoming uh, unpredictable this was last position taking very quick a scalp with a small profit and we are closed now and close it for the day thanks for your attention hope these trades are useful for you and let us know if you have any questions have a wonderful day and weekend